guys, it's Janet, and welcome back to Vivid's channel. Today I'm making rock candy, and all we're going to need to make the rock candy is water and sugar. But you can also add some flavoring and um, some food dye to make it more pretty. And we're also going to be using these sticks and clothespins and some jars. So let's get started. First, we need to boil the water. Now add one cup of sugar at a time until one cup boils and then you can add another cup. I just added the um, lemon flavoring, so now I'm going to add the yellow food dye. Now put it in a jar and let it cool for 20 minutes. Okay, now I'm going to do the same thing, but with the raspberry um, flavoring and red food dye. Now we're going to make the orange flavor. And the last one we're going to be doing is just a regular sugar flavor with blue food coloring. Okay, now we're going to take our stick and then dip it in water. And then we're going to roll it around in the sugar so it's covered in sugar. Now set it to the side and let it dry for a minute. Okay, now set these to the side, and after these cool down, we can put the sticks into the jar. And we did this last year, but it didn't work, so we hope this time it'll work. So now we're going to put these sticks in there, but first, we have to make sure there's at least like a one or like a one and a half inch space on the bottom. So like maybe like right there. So I can take the clothespin. Like measure it around stuff and then like clamp it right here. And then we're gonna put it in. I'm just wondering no. what you're doing. Now let it sit here for about five days and let it crystallize and we hope it works this time. Okay, today is the second day. The, we have let these sit and 
crystallized and um, these three are doing pretty good so far but this one um, this one like the whole thing crystallized and we made another one of the lemon flavored ones but I don't think it's growing anything only on the tip and if you look at the very tip of the stick it is growing something and then on the bottom of the jar. The bottom of the jar will eventually grow up to touch the stick. The best one, if you want to know which one is the best one, it's the orange one. The orange one is the best one. A lot is growing on the stick. The red one looks kind of nice, but only a little bit hey, is growing on the one. stick. You bent this one. I did? Sorry. Oh, actually the blue one is growing pretty good on the stick too. Yeah, but this is just solid, solid sugar. Can you pull it out? You can't, it won't even, you can try. Can I try? Lift it up, lift it straight up. You can oh. lift it right off the table. Oh, no. You pulled out? Okay, today's the fifth day, and um, most of them are doing good. These three are doing pretty good, and the yellow one is slowly growing. But the orange one, um, the candy part, the crystallized part that we want, is getting stuck to the bottom. So we have to take that one out now. So, we have this jar. I'm going to put this out and put it in here so it can dry and drip. Pretty small, but it looks really good. There's some, you know, crystals on it. Really shiny. And um, the red and the blue one are um, really big, and but they still have some space to grow, so we're gonna let that grow. And the yellow one, we have to let it grow because it has barely anything on it. Now leave it in there and let it dry for at least four hours. Okay guys, it's been seven days since we first put them in. And these two are doing really good, so we're going to take them out today. But the yellow one um, is doing really good, but it's going really slowly, so we're going to do that another day. So let's take them out. Now let these sit in here and dry for at least four hours. And we can also reuse this um, this solution here by putting it in a pot and boiling it and then add a cup of sugar and then let it all boil and dissolve the sugar. And then you can put another stick of sugar in it and then let it sit. And we did this one with the orange one. And it did really good because we did it like two days ago and it has a lot of crystals in it. So we're also going to take that one out today. Okay, this one's the old orange one. There's not that much color to it, and it's already dry. It looks really good. This is how they look side by side, and we use a different stick for the newer one right here.
Okay, now I'm gonna reuse these to make um, um, one more candy. So all we need to do is pour this in. Now add one cup of sugar. Now I'm gonna add more food dye in it to make more colorful. Okay guys, we let them sit for a while now and they've dried. So, Tan K, do you want to um, come taste us on our rock candy? Yes, please. Yeah, with the rock candy. Okay, um, we're going to four, so you guys can pick your stick. But I kind of want the blue one. Ladies first. The blue, what flavor is that? No flavor. Is this sugar? No flavor? Yeah. This is the only one without flavor. Okay, what are the other flavor options? Raspberry and orange. They're both orange. These are both orange. The yellow, the lemon one is still working. And this is Where's the lemon one? Right here. Oh, still hasn't grown yet. Yeah. Full grown. You can have, you can pick first. I'll take an orange and then let Kate pick whichever one she wants. Give me the smallest one, please. Thank you. The smallest one? Well, then I'll try raspberry. I'll try a different one. Hey, you pooped. Doesn't smell like oranges. Okay, what do we do? Just cheers. Eat it. It's so pretty. Oh, look at the different colors. Look at how they sound. They sound cool. They don't. They're not that colorful though. No. Okay. I guess we'll just gnaw them on in. Well, <laughs> tastes like sugar with a little bit of orange. Do you taste raspberry? Mm -hmm. Are we scoring these on our one to 10 opinions? Mm -hmm. Have you ever had one of these before? Uh, maybe like... Long time ago? Yeah, maybe like a long time ago when I was a little kid, but not in a long time. It's pretty good. All right, Kate, give it a score. One to ten on the rock candy scale. First. Ladies first. Yeah. Ladies first. Uh, maybe a... Okay, your turn. Your turn. Mm. Kids would probably score this pretty high, so I'm going to give it a... 8.3. I said 8.7. Yeah, she did. Okay. Okay. Let me try it. 